Welcome back to LNL Honeycomb Homestead. I am Luffy, and today, if you see by the title, it's not no joke, y'all. When it's not no like a regular burger, it's not no regular Whopper, it's not no regular Big Mac. This is Lovey's burger, okay? When I say burger, have you ever sat back and just said, mmm, that burger was really good, really good, but you don't want to get back up and fix another one because it'd be just so good? Well, I got a, I got a solution for that. I, I got a solution for that. So that's by the title. This is a big A burger, okay? Big A burger. Okay, y'all, so before we get started now, I don't know where your brain is at, at this moment. You're probably saying, Lovey, we've had hamburgers before. There's nothing to making a hamburger. But you haven't had this hamburger. Okay, you hadn't had my hamburger. And if you are watching this video, subscribers, people coming on, uh, you're gonna see a hamburger, okay? That's why I have it in the title, a big A burger, okay? A big A burger, okay? So I'm gonna quit talking. I'm gonna quit talking. And I'm gonna tell you now what we getting ready to do to make this big A burger, okay? So put on your aprons, put on your little hats, and y'all, let's let's get to it, okay? Just let's get to it. I'm getting ready to tell you now what we got as far as ingredients, all right? Let's do it. going on in this pan right here with this bowl okay i have all my goodness in here salt pepper garlic powder onion powder smoked paprika some uh diced onions and all that okay all of that okay you probably saying she making a meatloaf no there's more to it than a meatloaf but this is what i got for my burger that ain't all okay we're gonna mix all this up and then I got me some orange onions, right? We're going to caramelize these bad boys. Yeah, I said it. We're going to caramelize these onions. And then I sliced up some potatoes. I got them sitting off in this water so they won't turn brown on us. Because instead of me frying these bad boys, I'm going to put them in the oven. So we'll have some nice, good french fries, okay? Now, they're not those stringy french fries that you would see in a restaurant, okay? These are big steak-like fries right in there, okay? And that's what's going to be going in the oven, okay? And then we're going to have some cheese, and, you know, we're going to have, you know, we're going to have the work spinach, you know, mixed greens and all that stuff for the toppings and all that good things. But we're not there yet. We're talking about this meat right here. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and rub my hands all up in here and y'all wash when i say wash wash your hands that soap water or whatever else you got in there sanitize them hands and y'all take off the rings take them off too because we're getting ready to get in this meat right here so while i'm running my mouth that's what we're going to do we're going to just go ahead and mix this up because y'all um this is about a pound of ground beef. Yeah, I said it. I told you it was going to be a big burger, didn't I? Now, I didn't say no little burger. Don't sit there and say I did it. Don't say I said it because I did not say we were going to have a hamburger. I said we are going to cook a big A burger. Didn't I say that? Did y'all hear me? A big A burger. So, in the meantime, you already know. I cooked up some bread. Not just any bread. A big A, what? <laughs> buns. Yes, big A buns. Not no small 
hamburger buns. Not no cheeseburger, little burgers like this. Look, this recipe right here that I'm getting ready to bring to y'all. This big A burger. This right here is going to feed at least four people. And if you keep on cutting it, you might end up feeding six people. But since, like I said, it's just me and them, right? There's no sense of me just cooking all these hamburgers. Like I told you in the beginning, y'all. Y'all gonna mess around and cook these egg on burgers. Because that's what's been happening. You've been fixing your burger. And then you be like, dang. That was a that was some good burger right there. That was a good burger. But then you don't want to get back up and fix another one. Right? So guess what? I'm eliminating all that. I'm eliminating all of that. So you see I just mixed all those seasonings in that, right? Did you see that? Right. So with one hand. So now we're gonna just take that. We're gonna make a ball. What you think? Well hey. It ain't gonna be that big because it's gonna shrink. Now if you got butcher box, if you saw the video the other day. Butcher box don't shrink, baby. These are grass fed animals right here. That stuff is not gonna shrink on you. Just like they do in the store. And then you're having to go buy some lean meat and stuff like that. But your box, they know what kind of meat to get for these folks. You know what I'm saying? You do know what kind of meat to get, don't you? Yeah. All right. So you see I'm patting it on now. You think it's that big? Mm -mm. We're going to keep on patting because we're getting ready to, y'all, you know, we're getting ready to have a big A burger. Yeah, y'all seen it. Y'all seen it. Funny thing is. Ed don't have no clue. He thinks I'm just going to come in here and fix a burger. Now, y'all know, if y'all been watching the channel here lately, the hawk is always busy. He's always coming around as soon as he smells some food and always got to be eating, right? Well, I'm fixing that. He has no clue that this is a big A right here. This big A <laughs> is getting ready to happen. <laughs> Big A is getting ready to happen. So as you see in the background, I had one of these right here. Yeah, so I'm going to be sauteing my onions over here. And I'm going to be cooking this burger, this Big A burger, over here. And you don't want to start out cooking your meat all, all fast and stuff. You know, you're going to have to let this stuff just cook slow. Like, you know, you want it to get even all the way over. You don't want nothing breaking on you. You want the perfect round big a burger right now y'all heard me when i sat there and told you i got some bread in the oven and it ain't just any type of bread it's some big a buns okay i'm gonna quit talking to you because i guess y'all don't believe me right that's why i got big a fries big a burger so you see i'm just steady going back and forth with this ground beef right i'm molding it to the size I need it to be because I got some big A buns in the oven waiting to come up and I'm not going to show you that bad boy until the end when it's time to assemble this burger okay so yeah we're going to go ahead and get this on here right just like that just like that you see that huh I'm going to bring you up close I'm going to bring you up close. You're going to be like, let me see. Let me look. Step back. Step back. I'm going to bring you. I'm going to bring you up close. I promise you I am. Let me get this good on here. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to bring y'all up close so you can see what the main topic, the main title of this video is. Big A Burger. Okay. Big A Burger. Let me, let me let me wash my hands and I'll, I'll bring you up a little closer, okay? Just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. Hey, y'all. So I brought y'all on up close. Yeah, up close and personal. Yeah, y'all see it? Look at this burger. Now, like I said, I want my stuff to start cranking up slowly, okay? You don't want to cook this meat fast. Not, not me, anyway. I don't know how y'all do it, but this is how Lovey does it, okay? I like to get my heat just slowly just coming up, just like this. Can you see it? Huh? Yeah. You see that big A burger? You see that? You see that meat? Okay. I told you now. 
Okay, this is Lovey's Burger. This is not your burger. This is Lovey's Burger. This is how I fix my burgers. Now, like I told you, me and him have been married seven and a half years, right? He's had the other burgers. I fixed them. But he hadn't had Lovey Burger. And I think it's time for him to have Lovey Burger. When I say that man eat, that man eats. Okay? So, it's going to take him a while to eat this one. <laughs> Leave a comment down below. Do you think he's going to be able to eat all that in one setting? No. I'm going to get my little slice in, though. But not hell. He ain't going to be able to. He's not going to be able to eat this like that. Okay? And, um, uh, yeah, we, we, we're working on that. So now, I'm getting ready to, um, put some butter over here on this side. It's good and hot now. And we're going to go ahead and just saute the onions over there on the other side. So, yeah. Yeah, I'll see it. Just let this bad boy cook. Because I want it to cook nice and slow. Yeah. Just like that. Okay. So, yeah. Y'all up and person. Up and close. Very up and close. All in my space. All in it. But guess what? I'm showing y'all something. Okay. This meat ain't shrinking at all. Okay. Okay, so you see this. So we can ready to uh, saute these things. Put a little butter over here. Yeah. So we're going to have a lot of onion, y'all. So we're going to put some onion over here. And, uh, yeah, all that good stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We're going to put all that on over here. Get this onion on here and get this stuff started. Over here, and uh, yeah, get it on over here and get it started because we gotta get these trimmings on. We gotta get our trimmings ready for this big A burger. What you think? Now, look, man, I'm telling y'all, y'all want this burger, you better start leaving me a comment down below. You know who you are. You know who you are. If you watching this, subscribers, y'all watching this, if you're close to home, you know what I'm talking about. These are one of these burgers that uh, you just can't resist. They ain't just coming up on here <laughs> just to be looking cute. Who do that? Nobody doing that. I'm on here to show you what love you can do. Okay, what Lovey can do. Alright, how about that? Okay, so while these are over here, getting that little saute on, uh, this is doing his little magic over here. And uh, I'm gonna come on back, you know, in a few more minutes. Because then. When I come back, it'll be time to flip this bad boy over, and then y'all be able to see me do that, too. So, we're going to just let this stuff cook for a while. Got the whole house smelling good. Girl, shut up. Shut up. Okay, family, so, as you can see, first things first, before we even jump into really just going back over there to that food because it's going to take a minute. We're moving slow, okay? We're moving slow. So, I took the potatoes. You already know I rinsed them off real good. I strained them and stuff. I towel blotted them because we don't want them wet. And uh, in the South, if they're homemade, they're not called French fries. They're called like JoJo's or, or Fat Fries. That's what we call it down here in the South. Yeah, because this is not no restaurant. You know what I'm saying? These are going to be the real deal. Fat fries. So you got a cookie sheet. We're going to stick these fat fries, right? JoJo's, right? We're going to stick these bad boys on this sheet pan. Okay? We're going to just spread them on out of here. You see that? We're going to spread them on. Spread them on here because uh, we're getting ready to I mean, dive into this. But it's not over. You think I'm just going to throw them in there like that? N no. Now it's time for the seasonings, okay? So, 
Uh, we're gonna throw in some, 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 some about garlic. Okay, we're gonna throw some garlic on these fries. Okay, because these fries are gonna be fire, y'all. We're gonna throw them in with some garlic. We're gonna put some garlic over here on this. Okay, just the eyeball it. Do it how you want. You know what I'm saying? Because we're gonna mix this up anyway. Okay, this is gonna be <laughs> fire, y'all. This is gonna be so good. I ain't lying. This is gonna be good. And if you're just coming on the show, y'all, uh, like this, like this video, subscribe, leave a comment down down below. Tell me what you think so far. Tell me what you good. Tell, tell me, tell me what you think so far. We're gonna put some pepper on here. Okay, we're gonna put some pepper. Yeah, we're gonna put some pepper. Okay, we're gonna put a little bit of that pepper in here. Okay, we're gonna put a little bit of that in there. Boy, if it smells so good in here. Okay. We're gonna put some of that on there. Uh, we're gonna throw in some. We're gonna we're gonna throw in some smoked, okay? Some smoked paprika, okay? Some smoked paprika, okay? Because we're gonna mix all this up. This ain't just any type of <laughs> side fried JoJo's, okay? Not fried, it's JoJo's, okay? All of that, all of that. One more ingredient. And we're not gonna forget that. I'm just gonna just put a little bit of this salt in my hand because we don't eat a whole lot of salt. It's gonna have a lot of that anyway on that burger. So we don't just kind of balance it out on that burger, okay? So we're just putting a little bit in there. We don't need a whole lot of salt, okay? Just like that, like so, okay? And then one more thing, we need some onion powder. We love some onion in this house. I don't know about y'all, but uh, we love onion powder. Okay, we don't be half-stepping when it comes to onion powder. Okay, none of that. Okay, and remember, I'm not frying this up. I'm putting this in the oven. Okay, I'm putting it in the oven. So now we're gonna just mix this stuff up, up just like that, just like that. You see that? We're gonna mix all that up. We're gonna put that on back on over here. Don't be running off, don't be running. Don't be running. Okay, we're sticking this in the oven. Okay, we're gonna stick it in there. You wanna put it on about 400, okay? We're gonna start off with 400. So that bad boy can cook. Okay, and it's not over. This is not over. Now we're gonna add, you know what I'm saying? Our oil to this. Rinse my hands off. Y'all better be washing your hands when you cook. I ain't playing. That's nasty if you don't. Nasty. I'm gonna tell you, I'll be the first to tell you, if you don't wash your hands <laughs> before you cook, ain't nobody got no, mm -mm. we're gonna leave that alone. You better, you better, uh, you better wash your hands. That's all I got to say. Don't be nasty. You better wash them hands. And we got a little bit of oil and that's all you need is just a little bit of oil. Okay, you're gonna just, you're gonna drizzle that oil. Over these JoJo's. You don't need a whole lot of oil, y'all. I'm telling you. Don't need a whole lot. Get that good little drizzle on. Yes, there was some in there. Don't sit there and say it was empty because it wasn't. Don't play. Don't play. Now we're going to stick this in the oven, y'all. We're going to stick it over here in the oven. Okay. We're going to set that timer for a good uh, 30 minutes. Cause we got some things to do, just like that. I told you I was bringing you back over here, didn't I? Okay, so let me check on these little onions. You know, it's smelling good too. You don't want to burn them. You just want a little bit of uh, crisp, but not burnt. You know what I'm saying? You want to have that little. I can't describe it. You know what it is if you're a cook. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking. Like a a caramelized taste. It's not burnt. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all know what I'm talking about, don't you? You know what I'm talking about. Okay, it's just about how I want it to be. Almost. Just about. I'm gonna take these off and keep that keep that heat going on there because uh, <laughs> I'm gonna have to show you these buns. I'm gonna have to show you these buns. You know what I'm saying? Now we getting ready to. Uh, Look, this meat. 
Y'all see this? Do y'all see this? Wow. Yeah, buddy. You see that little sear on that? On that bad boy? Man, y'all. Y'all quit playing. Anyway. 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 Y'all see that? Do y'all see that? Okay. Let's get with the breed. Okay, y'all, so now it's time to get ready to assemble this big A burger, okay? So, you seen I had sauteed uh, some onion, and we ain't gonna forget about the bacon. We're not gonna forget about that bacon, okay? And then I got me some mixed greens right here, and I got these buns. Y'all already seen it, and then I already cut that bad boy up, and it's ready. And I'm gonna put this over here so it can kind of brown itself. And then I'm going to take you over to the other assembly line that's over there. And we're going to slice up some cheese. And we're going to make an avocado dressing. Yeah, you heard it. Avocado dressing. And uh, yeah. Y'all ready? Let's get started. So I'm going to get this bad boy on here. Get it where it's good. And get it to brown. And like I said... You want to move things slowly. So I'm bringing this on up to temp so we can get it to brown on the bottom. And we're going to do the same for this as well. Okay. And then we're going to go over there to the semi line as we speak. And let's go ahead and do that while that is getting brown. Okay, y'all. So we're going to make this avocado dressing. And I'm going to show you how to do it. We're gonna take an avocado, we're gonna cut it right down the middle to split that bad boy open, okay? Like so. <clears throat> and we're gonna take the avocado and put it in this mixer right here. We're gonna put it right on in here. Stick it all up in here. Okay, scoop the seed up out of here. We're gonna stick that avocado right in there. Okay. And we're gonna make sure we get all that avocado out of here. I don't miss nothing, y'all. I don't miss nothing. Okay, so there's the avocado. We're sticking that in there. Okay, next thing you're gonna do is put a little bit of lemon juice in there. I don't know how much, because I've been doing this for a minute. Okay, we're gonna have some lemon juice. If y'all try to do this recipe right, you just go by the taste. That's all I can tell you. Just go by the taste, because you'll know you're gonna need a little bit of garlic powder. Or well, this is this is um, onion powder. You're gonna put a little bit of onion powder in there. Okay. You're gonna put a little bit of garlic powder in there as well. Just a little bit. It don't have to be a whole lot. Just put some in there. Okay. Because you wanna bring some flavors up. And then you're gonna put some pepper in there. This is going to be a cream consistency. Just a little bit of pepper. And then you're going to put you some salt in there. Like I said, we don't use a whole lot of salt. Just a little bit. A little bit of salt. Okay, you're going to put all those in there. You're going to turn that bad boy in. It's going to come to a cream consistency. It's going to be creamy. I'm 
one point. But we're gonna take that on over here. And I'm gonna tell you what all we're gonna put together. Yeah, hey so while we was over there making that dressing, I had this bread over here, just the browning. You see that? Good and warm. Good and warm. Now we got this meat. Before we do, we'll have our onions, bacon, spring lettuce, some cheese, and I'll show you that here in a minute. We got that. And now we're getting ready to take this burger, this egg burger, and go ahead and get ready to put this on here. So first of all, the first thing I do, okay, we're going to take this and we're going to spread this avocado dressing right over this big egg burger. Okay, we're going to put this all on here. Okay. And yeah, there might be some chunks. But there's nothing like having some chunks because everything is big up in here. Everything is going to be big in here. You're probably like, mm-mm, this is nasty. No, it ain't. This is my burger. Fix it how you want to fix it. Okay, fix it how you want to fix it. This right here is fine. I'm going to put that little dressing on there. You don't want it liquidy. You don't want it none of that. You want it to be just right. Kind of like a thick consistency in a sense. You see them chunks, y'all? I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna bring y'all a little closer. Look at that. Y'all wanna see? All right, look. You see that? You see that? You see all that goodness? Alright, bring down me back. So that way you can see a little bit better. Okay. We're gonna put this all on here. Okay. We're gonna finish because we're gonna finish this on out of this thing. We ain't wasting nothing. We're not gonna waste nothing. That burger's gonna be good hot. We're gonna be on here too. We ain't wasting anything. Yeah, I think the hot gonna enjoy this. <laughs> I do. Let's put this bad boy right on here. Look at that. Okay, so now we're gonna put some cheese. We're gonna skip that cheese already on here. We're gonna skip on some cheese. That cheese is gonna be melted eventually on here. Yeah, we're gonna stick that on here. See that? Yeah. Scoop this up. I have no idea what I did with my knife, so we're gonna put this all on there. See that cheese? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're gonna stick that on there. Ain't nobody sure it come in So now we're gonna throw these toppings on there. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I'm gonna get that up too. Ain't nobody missing anything. Nothing. Yeah. Now we're gonna stick some bacon on there. Stick that bacon right up on here. And I even stick some over here on the little ears right here. Just around for each bite. Yeah. Right around for each bite. Let's put that on there. Right around for each bite, y'all. For each bite. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be good. Who wants one? Huh? Who wants a burger? The A burger. Who wants that? I do. Okay, we're gonna stick that on there. Now we got all the good and onions all on here. Get it good and spread it up on there. Yes, yes. Now we're gonna do the springs spring lettuce. Don't worry. They've been rinsed off as well. Because we wash our stuff. Yeah. That's on here. We're going to stick that on here. Very good and healthy. Healthy in between. <laughs> healthy in between. Who likes colorful food? I do. I'm going to put some of this. Mm -hmm. Yep. We're going to put all that in. Look like a salad, don't y'all? Look like a salad. Does it look like a salad? Yeah. 
được ý tưởng ý tưởng cũng đang bán ý tưởng ý tưởng ấy em ok you see it I'm gonna bring you up close I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring you up close I'm gonna bring you up close okay so this is up and personal y'all look at this burger the big A big A burger right so you already know I got it on this tray cause you know what's missing them doggone fries those JoJo's Southern say JoJo's so guess what I'm getting ready to show you that too hey y'all do y'all see it So y'all, look, we're going to call the Hulk in here. He's never seen this. He has never seen this burger, ever. So um, we're going to call him in here, but we're going to have to cut this burger before we even get started as far as eating this. So I'm going to call him in here, and we're going to get his first impression and expression on this burger. And then I'm going to cut it. And then we're going to taste it. How about that? Let's call him in here. Right now. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to have to cut this burger. And, yeah, the Hulk, he's going to give you some words. <laughs> I ain't never seen nothing like it. See how big this thing is? I'm about to cut that in a fourth. Yeah. Because your mouth ain't going to cover all of it. <laughs> it's a burger. Hey, hey. Burger. Big A. What? Burger. And I'm gonna Y'all Y'all hear you, you see you see the look he's giving, right? Yeah. And I'm gonna bring it up so y'all can see. After I had cut it up. <laughs> Leaving y'all in suspense. You see, I had to cut it. I had to cut it in half twice, y'all. So, you ready to show everybody the taste test? Yeah. I don't know if I can bite that thing. <laughs> well, let's just see. Go ahead. Yeah. 
Yeah. It's gonna pass the test. Well, there you have it. The Big A Burger, y'all. If y'all like this video, if y'all like this video, give it a thumbs up. Okay, leave a comment down below. Subscribe to our channel. Hit all on that subscription bell button, okay? See, that way you'll know you're notified on every video that we do. And y'all, have yourself a wonderful and blessed day. Bye-bye.